Hello once again and welcome back to the Wayside Carveleting channel here on YouTube and uh, welcome to another video and this one will be a little bit different today. Today we are going to do an engine bay detail of the Golf R. Uh, it isn't that dirty but I want to have a go at it and get it looking pristine. There has been a lot of salt on the roads, the car has been looked after so I do keep the uh, engine bay area clean most times but I actually haven't done a full detail of it. So this is what the video is all about. So the products I'm going to use, well, I'm going to give it a rinse down of using my pressure washer in this. I'm going to be putting on the MTN SGS28, uh, this nozzle here, that's my 40 degree fan and I'll be using a low pressure uh, so I don't put too much water into the engine bay area. Uh, the next product, it's going to be, well, the first product, should I say, after rinsing it down, I'm going to use Yum Undress. Now this is generally used as a tire cleaner, uh, but it says you can use it at the bottom uh, on your engine bay detailing process and it will break down stubborn oil stains and grease. So I'm going to use that neat on the engine bay. Um, so we'll see how that does and we'll use a detail brush and uh, in the bucket, uh, no water, just a small amount of water needed. I'll use the pressure washer to dampen down the wheel willies and the detail brushes, but that'll be also uh, after it's all rinsed down again, I'll then be putting a diluted version of uh, Yum Dress version 2. That'll be uh, using um, 10 to 1 ratio and I will be putting that in the Prezel sprayer, household sprayer. Great piece of equipment this, do recommend them. Uh, I've already put uh, a little bit of version 2 in the bottom there and I'll be diluting that down with water very shortly. Good, so that's about it, that's gonna be it. We'll get the um, process started, as you saw in the intro there. I've got the car out, it's on the driveway, ready to go. And uh, then what happens is, once you've finished uh, putting the uh, dress version two on the uh, engine bay area, you shut the bonnet and leave it. Uh, and I'm gonna leave it overnight in the garage and I will be basically uh, coming back to it tomorrow morning and we'll see the results then. So let's get on with it. Enjoy.
Okay, so light's fading now. Um, basically, that is the coating on now uh, after those uh, clips there of um, the actual degreasing using Yum Undress and the application of uh, Yum Dress version two. I've shut the bonnet. I'm gonna bring the car into the garage uh, after this and then that'll be it till tomorrow morning. Um, right, let's hope the results are going to be something else. One thing to add, I did put a plastic bag over my alternator. So uh, that was just a visible, so I was able to put the plastic bag over it and that was the only thing I'd covered. The battery was fine and uh, as you would have seen there, I used not too much water uh, in the rinsing process, um, but enough to get what I thought needed to be removed for uh, the preparation of the coating. Right, see you in the morning. Okay, good morning, welcome back. It's the next day now, and uh, so it's been a full night now since uh, we closed the bonnet there and um, left Yum Dress version two to dry with the heat that was uh, from the engine. Uh, so I've had a peek already and uh, you're about to see it. It looks amazing. Um, very impressed and the uh, coating has dried it's very glossy it looks like brand new under the bonnet now uh, compared to what it was which wasn't too bad before but anyway here come some clips if you've enjoyed this video do give it a like do subscribe here come the clips enjoy So there you go, what did you think? Uh, put the, what you think in the comments. Uh, to myself, like I said, in just before I showed you those clips there, I think uh, it's come up very well indeed. Um, it's quite an easy process. Uh, once you do uh, spray water on the bonnet, or I keep saying the bonnet, in the engine bay area, it's, it's, it's nerve wracking, but uh, you know, I've, I've not had any alarms on the car, there's not been any faults or I've checked the lights, the window wipers, you know, the heating, everything, blah, blah, blah. Everything seems okay. And uh, otherwise the results are outstanding. Uh, I do recommend giving it a go. I know most people out there already do engine bay detailing, uh, but uh, that was my first time and uh, thoroughly enjoyed it. And I'm very pleased with the results. Okay, that's it for today's video. I uh, hope you've enjoyed. Like I say, give it a like and do subscribe. Until the next time, thank you very much. And regards to everybody, all the best now. Goodbye.